guys, welcome to another video of My Vida Loca. I know I probably look like a little egg right now. I don't really have makeup on, um, just lipstick. But, um, anyways, yeah, I'm at my mom's and I'm not feeling the best. It's not COVID, but there's like a bug going on, allegedly. <laughs> um, and so I just haven't really been feeling the best in like a week. But I have some exciting news. So I got a kitten. I got a kitten. I got a kitten. I had an interview this past week um, to get approved for a kitten, and I I got him. Um, it's a little gray cat. Closest resemblance would be a Russian blue. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited. So we're gonna go get him. I'm gonna show you a little Dollar Tree haul that I got right now, apart like from the stuff that I got on Amazon for him. I don't need a lot because I already had stuff from Butter and Hillary. Um, so thankfully I don't have to spend too much, but this is the first time I'm gonna own two cats at once. So Butter definitely is gonna have to get used to him and I have to make sure that the baby's safe and then that Butter's also safe. Um, so I did buy him a little playpen and I'll show you guys that once I get home. Like I said, I'm at my mom's, but I pick him up on Saturday and I'm so happy I cried. Um, but anyways, I did go to the Dollar Tree just because like dollar stores, I just, I just love them. And I explained that before in other videos. Um, cause you just like get a lot of cute little things that like, you're like, you really don't need, but whatever. Um, so I wanted to show you guys what I got in relation to the cats, um, and yeah, so let's do that. Let's do a little uh, haul, Dollar Tree haul. And um, yeah, then the journey of getting the babe will begin. Okay, so this video specifically is just gonna be the stuff that I've bought in to prepare for a new cat or two cat household and a kitten. So the next video that I post next week will actually be the journey of me getting the kitten like on my way there and meeting him for the first time, him and Butter meeting for the first time. And then I will probably do like one more video just to kind of update on how they're doing in getting along. Um, but that probably will come like way later. But anyways, yes, I went to the Dollar Tree because where I live in LA, there's not a lot. And well, there, that's probably a lie, but there's none near me. So my mom lives right near one. So I was like, let me pop in there and see what, Cool stuff is there because I also love crafts but I have like a whole drawer full of crafts that I don't use but anyways I got this cute thing this one I'm, it's like it's really flimsy it's a dollar a dollar 25 now by the way but um it says you had me at meow <laughs> so I'm gonna put this right outside my door when we come in these are trays for eating but I'm actually gonna put them I'm gonna have three litter boxes now. Butter just already had two litter boxes. Um, ones that covered litter, if you haven't watched that video and like how I use natural litters, that's literally one of the first videos that I've ever posted and it has a decent amount of views, like 3,000 or something. Um, so if you wanna check that out, go ahead and check it out. I us talk about like uh, cat like acuity and about like how to help your cat um, hunt but it's just like these little things that my brother got me. Again, that's in that video too, but. So yeah, these are supposed to be for food, which um, I'm not gonna use for food. I'm gonna use for litter, putting it under the litter and right outside where they come out because then you can just dump it out instead of having to sweep over and over again. So I got two, even though I'm gonna have three litters. Um, I didn't think that I was gonna have this third one. It's like a jumbo one, but I'm gonna actually put that one in the balcony. And then um this is at the dollar tree which is really good and it's pink because we don't care colors are not gender uh whatever you know what i mean like there's no gender attributed to colors even though we live in a society that tries to do that so i don't really care for the fact that it's pink uh i just cared that it was a dollar 25. i had already bought one from pet smart though that i had originally um from when i got butter but then I got butter, a different one. And so that's at home. I'll show you guys that when I get home too. This is not from there. It's not for that. A poncho. Oh, and then I got these cute ones. So these will definitely be for the food. And I got two because um, the babe and butter are gonna have two eating and drinking stations because especially now when they're just getting used to each other, I don't want butter to feel threatened. 
um, and the baby is just gonna be the baby but at the same time he's been raised with his siblings and his mom so I want the baby to get used to it too but he's gonna be in his little playpen for a little while or in the bathroom because we have to separate them um, but yeah for the meantime like once they get used to each other they're gonna have their own little feeding sections and then eventually I guess if they don't care to share I mean you know like if they don't mind sharing then I'll drop down to one and then I got this because I also went on Amazon and I've done this for Hillary I've done this for butter um so Hillary on the day that she died I actually put her print it's actually not going to be this one it's going to be these so you put their print their paws um and Hillary I had done her clay like years ago and then the day that she died I did this and then I framed it so I'm actually going to frame it in this which was also a dollar um, and so the baby, I bought on Amazon these non-ink transfers. So you're going to put the ink pad and then you just touch it. And wherever you touch it is what transfers. So I'm going to do that instead of putting um, paint on the fur. Even though, of course, if you're going to do that, just make sure it's non-toxic paint. But it's just annoying to get it out of the fur. So I didn't want to do that. Um, this is also for a dog. But it's basically to kind of help stimulate the cat. And uh, this cat is not a Russian blue because he's not purebred. He's actually a domestic short hair, butter is a domestic medium hair. But I think it's short hair is because he was fluffy when he was a baby. Um, but Russian blues are supposed to be really intelligent. Um, and so either way, whatever breed that you have, it's kind of cute. I know it's a bone again, like I said, it's for a dog. But you put a treat in here and you let the cat try and find where the treat is. Like the, the cat's gonna see where you put the treat. But um, yeah, so that's a little game. And then I got him a little harness. Butter already has one. Um, and I don't tend to like these, um, but I got one anyway. And it's basically the color of his skin tone. Uh, he is, he's honestly kind of like the color of this <laughs> he's gray gray blue they call those cats um and then i got these socks because it looks like him and don't laugh but i got this baby blanket because i'm gonna try so when i first got butter i really tried to get him to be a cat that likes showers didn't happen didn't work and um, so i'm gonna have to get this baby used to it and so Obviously, you don't want to use like a regular towel because it's a lot of fur that's going to get placed unless you're willing to have that towel specifically be the cat towel. Um, Butter has one. It's 101 Dalmatians. So that's his designated towel. Um, So now the baby has a designated towel and I really like marine animals. So I got that. So basically, that's all I got from the Dollar Tree apart from other stuff that I got just because that's me. Um, there was also like a flea treatment thing. I don't like using um, anything that's really like not natural or holistic. Um, so I just got it because I think it's a decent brand and it's a dollar twenty-five. So should it ever be needed, there's gonna be that. Um, the Los Angeles is also gonna host um, a pet wellness day, and so I actually already have an appointment for both of them. Butter's gonna get microchips finally. The baby's already going to come microchipped in with his uh, primary vaccine. So he's going to get his follow-up vaccines on that day, all for free. And then Butter, it's been two years since he's gotten um, his Ravi vaccine and um, this other vaccine that he needs. So he's also going to get vaccinated that day. Um, so I'm going to take both of them. Butter in the stroller because he does a lot better there. And I'll probably vlog that too if you guys care. Um... But yeah, this is basically all that I got in preparation for the baby um, from the Dollar Tree. But like I said, when I get home, I'll show you guys the playpen that I got him. And then that'll be the end of this video. But yeah, I'm like so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Kind of like I was telling you guys in the video where I went to an adoption center. I was just really bummed out because I'm like, Oh my god, all of the cats are getting taken. I was like starting, I was telling the um, woman who interviewed me, her name's Carla. I was like, I was starting to like question like whether I'm like, 
a good cat parent and whether like it's the time that I should be doing this and that's why I cried when she said the baby's yours so yeah I'm really excited and I'm really happy that I get to kind of go through this journey with getting a new baby and then um my cats uh the registered emotional support animals so this one will have the same um registration as butter does and yeah it honestly couldn't have come at a better time i've been going through a lot emotionally and so when it came to just like thinking of like should i get another pet like i was thinking of like companionship for butter companionship for me and i really think it's like where i'm at in my life right now and so i think it's just time and yeah i'm happy so if you guys are down to like see what else i got when i get home then keep watching and i guess i'll catch you guys then bye looking a mess part two but anyways um i'm back in la for a little bit um and i came to basically grab my stuff um and i just wanted to show you the things that are here for the kitten that i also bought um and then i'll show you guys more tomorrow because the last of it comes tomorrow but basically this is where the baby's gonna be while we have butter here too he's gonna be in the bathroom but he's gonna be in this so they can get some exposure together have a little litter box for him i'm obviously gonna set up his food and his little bed came too but that's with my neighbor and then i got this too oh i did set up this little area under my desk um so that they have places to go and that's actually like a cooling uh blanket um because it's hot out here and then this actually got on my birthday if it looks familiar on the birthday vlog um yeah cats love boxes so they want to be in there it's fine so this is the next thing that i bought and it's the ink pads um so you're just gonna put baby's hands on there and it'll transfer and it comes with paper already, but we're gonna transfer it on to the painting canvas that I showed you guys. I know it looks so scary, but that's it for now. Tomorrow, the backpack's coming. Um, I got them wet food, and then I got them a toothbrush and <laughs> a toothpaste because I wanna get the baby started on liking brushing his teeth and Butter's gonna have to get used to it. Um, but I believe that's it. And then I have his little bed. Um, that is, it's really just like thin. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. One more day and I get the babe. That's going to be another video. But once I show you guys all the things, that'll close that video. And then actually getting the baby and all of that. Um, the baby, he's two months. So he technically is still a baby. Um, yeah. Um, uh, that'll be a whole other video, but yeah, I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. You got it. Okay, guys, so my neighbor actually came this morning, and this is a little bed that I was talking about, which is so funny because it's the size of him. I mean, because it's the color of him. Um, got a little mouse in here. And so then I already laid everything out. Um, he's going to be eating out of these for right now. Um, and then, yeah, his, like, litter box. I know it, it like, looks like it's all close together, but he's not going to be in here that much it's really just so that they can get you know the smells of each other um but yeah i'm excited so let's start with what's easy so this is just their cat food wet cat food then i also got them their toothbrushes and toothpaste so they both have one now I'm gonna have to look up when you can start doing this for babies. I don't know that it says ideal for kittens. So yeah, we got that. And then the next thing that we got is the 
pet carrier backpack. So that's this right here. Let me do it. Let me get it fixed up and then I'll show you. Okay, so pretty cool. It has this like really comfortable um, yet sturdy bottom. So then I guess you put that here. Okay, so here you go. Pretty legit. It's pretty sturdy. Has some nice pockets. Put some snacks in. And then they can it has these like little clips. So you can put them in through the front. And it has good ventilation on all sides. And then here for like water, right here is for like the doggy bags. And then you can put them up from the top too. I love that they added these safety clips because if you guys know, cats can definitely get out of this. Thank you guys for watching this little kitten, <laughs> new kitten haul. Um, I hope you enjoyed it, and if you're interested in any of these, it's in your Dollar Tree. I'll link the stuff that I got on Amazon. The next video is going to be, like, me actually meeting him, which you've met him now before. Um, but, yeah! Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys on the next one. Bye! See you, bye!